and thank you so much for coming back to my channel if this is your first video from me then hi I'm Giselle I post fashion and lifestyle videos on this channel so thank you so much for stopping by today's video I'll be showing you how to do the easiest DIY ever I think on this channel today's video is actually the very first video of my summer series that I'm starting on my channel it's really exciting to me because I haven't done a full summer series before I started this channel in August which is kind of like the end of summer so I'm really excited about all the summer videos that are coming up so definitely subscribe below if you don't want to miss a video in today's video I'll be showing you how to use two simple ways on how to recreate your own round beach towel slash blanket I think this is gonna be one of the hottest beach accessory trends this year both these methods take like no effort at all but if you guys do want to see more in-depth ways how to make your own unique beach round towel slash blankets definitely comment below and let me know because I have a lot of ideas but I wanted this one to be like really easy and like no so and them online can be quite pricey up to like a hundred or two hundred dollars online so I definitely think that a great alternative is to create your own yeah, that's basically all I have for you in this intro if you want to learn how to make your own round beach blanket then just keep on watching so for the first method of our round beach blanket I'm calling it the fringe cut because all you need is two yards of fabric and scissors first you want to fold your fabric lengthwise aka hot dog style and then fold it hamburger style and I'm just smoothing it out because I want to make sure I'm able to cut a perfect circle once you've done that you want to sketch out a half circle and it's kind of hard to explain but you can kind of see the shape that I'm going for here and you want to do that from one edge of the fold to the other corner once I completed that I started to cut out my half circle and once I got to the middle part I just folded the part that I already cut out and folded it on top of the other part so I can complete the circle and once you're done cutting it up it should look like this and in case anyone's wondering if you can't find a French terry type fabric like I couldn't find one myself so I thought that this lycra fabric was really cute for a beach blanket and I think lycra would be just as fine because it's kind of the same material that swimsuits are made of so if it does get wet then no worries. And I really want to fly this DIY for you guys and make it the most cost effective so I'm just using scissors to create fringe and I'm just doing that by cutting all around the edge about three inches high and just a quarter inch wide and pulling them so they become a little long and create a cleaner look. If you want to see a more in-depth version of this DIY of this beach round blanket then definitely give this video a thumbs up and comment down below to let me know and I'll be sure to do one showing you how to apply actual fringe trim. So believe it or not, the second method for this round beach towel is way more easy than the first method and requires only one step. All I did was take a tapestry that I got on Amazon and I'll link below the exact one that I use as well as a couple other affordable ones down in the description box below. Basically all you do is cut out the design using the circle pattern that the tapestry has and once you cut it all the way around, you can hem it or you can just leave it like that and you're done. Not only are these super cute on the beach, but you can also use it by the pool or even as a little decorative bedspread. Overall, I think these DIYs are super cute and highly Instagrammable for the summer and just really easy summer projects you can do with your friends or family. And there's an endless amount of fabrics out there so everyone can create their own unique one depending on their own unique style. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, definitely give it a thumbs up. And comment down below if you do want to see a more in-depth DIY on how to make a unique round beach blanket because these two methods were really easy and if you do want to see one that takes a little more effort and more like sewing skill like if you want to see one with like fringe around it or anything like that definitely comment below and I'll definitely do a video like that. If you don't want to miss a video in my summer series definitely subscribe below so you never miss any video and yeah thank you so much for watching I'll see you in my next video bye.